I know my naturalistas. Um, I just want to check in to show you a few things that I got in the mail today, and that would be my cream and cocoa body bath bars. So I got the Hawaiian volcano, and I bought this for my face. I did not buy this for my body. But I might just cut it in half and try it on my body just to see how it works out. So actually, I will use this for my body. I will cut it in half and use half of my body and half of my face. I got the Carrot Mango Milan Shampoo Bar. And I didn't buy this to use on my hair. You can use this on the hair or body. That's what it says on her website. And, um, and so I'm going to use all of these except for... Probably all of them as body bars and two of them as face bars as well. I got the paint cookie. I don't know what this is. Whatever it is. It's like rose petals or something. The one is coming off. But anywho, I got the banana smoothie. I got the chili mango. I got the raspberry and raspberry tea and lemonade and the lemon poppy seed cake which is another one I bought for my face but again I might cut it in half and use it on my body as well and then as a little gift she gave a little sliver of the honey pot and I did use this today it came today but I also used it today and so on my body and this is honey pot little gift that she gave and so okay so when I got the um, I want to say my experience with her with shipping um, I waited about now her norm is three to seven days it didn't say business days or anything like that but it did say three to seven days for you to for her to ship out i would say on the seventh day i got a email saying that my order has shipped now we all know that that don't really mean the order has shipped that just mean that she they printed out the shipping label so um this was on the fourth um on the fifth it showed that the post office had received the information or something to that extent. Well, after that, it showed nothing. It didn't show any tracking or anything. So I think by Saturday, um, I had some other stuff that was coming. And so I was just checking my mailbox every day. As you know, it's hot as the devil here. And I, you know, when I know I'm receiving products, I check my mail often when I know I'm not receiving anything but just bills. I check my mailbox maybe once or twice a week. But, um, you know, I just kept checking the tracking on it and, you know, checking my mailbox. And on the tracking, it wasn't tracking anything. It just kept showing that the post office had received it, the info. And so I emailed her on Saturday when I didn't get anything, just trying to, you know, see when, you know, just to let her know it wasn't showing anything. I did get the email saying that it was shipping or it had shipped, um, but the tracking wasn't posting anything and it had been a few days. And so um, I didn't hear anything back from her. So I know her September box was a little bit late. So I figured, well, maybe she just printed it out and she's trying to ship everything at one time, being that she has so much to ship with the um, September boxes that she's shipping out tomorrow. And so this morning I checked the tracking again. I didn't, I only emailed her the one time and I just wanted to wait until after she shipped out her boxes to see if she was just, you know, shipping everything together, which was not a problem with me. Um, so I checked the tracking this morning and it was early afternoon on the East Coast, but still morning here. And it still showed that the post office had just received the information, no tracking, no 
nothing that it had went anywhere. And so um, I said, well, I'll just wait until tomorrow. She's supposed to be shipping out these boxes. You know, I'll just wait. So me not being, I'm not very patient. I'm, I'm really not. So um, I checked it again. This here like early afternoon and then all of a sudden it goes from the post office just showing the information to it's out for delivery and it's in phoenix it was no in between like it had been anywhere else it just jumped from north carolina or wherever she is to phoenix and i went back and looked at it again i refreshed the browser just to see if it would show like the areas or the states it had we had tracked to and it was nothing it, it didn't even show any tracking it just showed from when it posted with the post office until it showed up in phoenix and out for delivery today um so i don't know what happened but i got them um then on to the way they smell now this is my first time buying her soap, so I only know what I've seen on YouTube videos, people reviewing her products. And I th thought for myself when I got them that they were just going to smell so good enough that I wanted to bite into them. Well, for me, I was a bit disappointed <laughs> because they didn't smell like that. It's almost like I have, for me, I have to really sniff it to smell the smell of each one of the bars and some are more stronger than others but to me they're really faint so that was one of the things I was kind of because they look so pretty um they really do but you know I was looking for these soap bars that was pretty looking that smelled so delicious and it just wasn't like that for me but they feel moisturizing they really do but I did, as I said, use the honey pot and I wasn't impressed with it. You know, this is just my honest review. I've used other soaps that left my skin really soft, really nice, no soapy feel, feeling. This kind of left a soap, soap film on my skin. I just didn't like the way my skin felt using the honey pot. So that wouldn't be a soap that I would buy and I'm glad I didn't buy um the full version of it because um I probably would have just gave it to my daughter because it is you know I didn't like the way it felt so I'm hoping that these other pretty bars will leave my skin feeling soft and you know not the soap feel you know that um I did have a cold, so I got these for, I think, $4 and some change each. Um, I got these for $4.20 each. Um, I used the cold that she had going at the time for like 20% off or something like that. I don't know. And so, um, yeah, so I'm just hoping that these other soaps really, really work out as they are probably... Half of them will be probably going to my daughter, except for my face bars. Um, that doesn't really matter as long as it gets my face clean. You know, it don't. You know, I, that's what I have my moisturizers and stuff for. So, yeah. So that's my take. You know, my first impression right now on cream and cocoa. Um, I still do want to try some of her facial products. You know, I'm not going to, you know, say I'm not going to buy from her just because one soap I didn't like. But, um, yeah, so hopefully I got seven soaps and hopefully <laughs> at least one or two of them will work out. So thanks for watching. Um, thanks for subscribing. I really appreciate it. If you haven't subscribed, press that, click that subscribe button. Um, and peace out.